Hello friends, my name is Coco and you don't know me and I don't know you, but I'm very happy you're alive today. For those of you that might be in a relationship, whether it's a you know boyfriend, girlfriend, husband, wife, significant other, whatever the case may be, sometimes when we have our depressive episodes we can feel like we are oceans apart from our significant other. And the best thing that we can do is we can communicate. And, you know, we hear that all the time. Communication, communication is the key in any relationship. But it is true. We can communicate with our partners and kind of give them like this little bread trail across this bridge that we're making when we feel like we're oceans apart. And uh, the little bread trail is just things that might help you or trigger words that might help get you out of your episode or, you know, your depressive state. So it could be... You know, um, some people might say, I just want to be held when I feel like everything's falling apart. And you let your partner know that. And so when you feel like your world's falling apart, all of a sudden they're holding you. Or you might say, just tell me that things are going to be okay. Or I, I need to know that, you know, you're going to say everything's going to be fine. And they say that when you're having your episode and you're just like, man, that's everything that I needed. Whatever you need to hear in that moment, let your partner know. Because the worst thing that your partner is feeling is, is that they see you suffering and they see you in a lot of pain and they can't help you. And again, we feel oceans apart and it's not just how we feel towards them or about our relationship, but they can also feel that way with us because of, you know, this episode because they don't know how to, they feel helpless and we in our own ways feel helpless too. So we can start to create that little bread trail to go across the bridge and start to let our partners know the things that we need. Or if we say, hey, you know what, I need a breather sometimes and I just kind of need a moment and... I'll be okay, then let them know that, you know, whatever it might be. If you're like, I need to build a fort in the middle of my living room and watch, you know, Disney movies or Golden Girls or Fresh Prince of Bel-Air until, you know, the sun goes down, let them know that because, you know, they love you and they're going to be so willing to do whatever it will take to make you happy or just at least to take some of that pain off of you, okay? So we can always start to build bridges. And sometimes we may feel oceans apart, but we're really not that far. We can still see each other. And so long as we can still see each other, there's still hope that we can reach each other, right? So I just wanted to share that with you guys. I felt that that was kind of important to talk about today. Anyway, I love you all. Do the best you can with all that anybody asks for. And remember, I am very happy you're alive today, okay? Have a great night, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.